In comparison to major techniques that are offered, there is a time delay in your waiting for a result. So this could vary from hours to days to weeks in some cases. What we do is treat pain and discomfort and the results are instantaneous. I'm looking for a change immediately. It's a light touch, it's not intrusive. It's very complementary, meaning it'll work with all other major therapies without uh, uh, negating some of their outcomes and if I was to put it into it's easy it's a nice easy way to let the body know that it may have to recalibrate to make some changes so that it could cope better with the situation it's in the difference between my therapy and some other touch therapies uh, like trigger therapy uh, or acupressure is in my case I see acupressure and trigger therapy as a way of holding a point under low a lot of pressure for continuous time till it submits mine is not mine's just creating a light touch of awareness so the brain can reevaluate what it is and then go and make its own adjustments I want the body to do its own job and if I can give it the right information like a good computer, I believe it has the ability to reevaluate and recalibrate itself. Sometimes I think we've got this uh, tendency to impose rather than uh, allow it to respond. Balance to me is the most important part. When a person walks out of there, I want to know that they can walk uh, with assurance, that they don't have to keep checking their feet every time they move around and then bump into a light post. I'm a simple person and that's what makes a technique so good. I think everyone has the skill to do what I do. I am just a person, a therapist who likes to get results. That's very difficult for me because I've never known the limitations. No, I, I have to say, as an Emma therapist, I'm a first aider. So if a person, even if they've got a broken bone, I can comfort them until other assistance comes. So when it's not my job, I'll pass it on to someone else who's good at it. Um, but that does not take me out of the equation. I can still sit there and give good comfort. Well, I think why it's grown so well is that it has been accepted as complementary therapy. A chiropractor, a doctor, uh, a physiotherapist or a massage therapist all get the same value out of the, out of the learning. And it doesn't say that they have to disregard their prior learning. I think that's what's taken it so quick. And I do believe that the simplistic way that I keep it it's got a lot to do. The average person, the mums and dads who want to help their family can do it, and those professionals who want to go out and take their learning on to greater heights or awareness, they can learn. Many, many competent therapists out there, many, and one of the nice things about it is I'm very pleased that they call it Emma Technique because I put total trust in these people to do a good job. So if anyone in Germany is looking to have what I've got to offer, all they've got to do is look up uh, the website and look to see what is available in there that are, that are highly trained. I'd like to take this opportunity to uh, introduce to you my instructors within the European area.
the first one would be of the senior Regishira, Astrid Haas, Thomas Williams, Barbara Shigula, and Julia Kirkler. I put my full faith and trust in them and look forward to hearing from you.